Hey guys, welcome back to another video where today I'm going to show you some of the best tips and tricks for PvP or combating or simply just fighting in your world. So if, make sure to watch the whole video since I'm going to be uh, telling some bonus tips at the end so you can know how to play. But if you're ready, let's get started. So number one tip is to have enough materials. So you have to at least want to have an iron sword, but it's better if you can upgrade it all the way to a diamond sword or even a netherite one. Please never use a golden sword. That is trash and everybody should know that. Next up, you want to have at least enough arrows, uh, a shield and get armor, possibly at least iron armor. And when it comes to arrows, you want to at least have an entire pack of like 64 arrows. And then you also might want to have other resources or like extra things such as extra swords or extra arrows, extra bows. Or you know, maybe you want to have pickaxes as well as food resources. And so now let's go up to number two which is to enchant things. If you have an axis on an enchanting table, please use that table to enchant stuff. It's gonna help you a lot and it's gonna make your weapon, your armor, or whatever you're gonna use stronger and it's just gonna make you stronger. So if you have enough uh, experience and lap is lastly thing, so then you should go ahead and enchant your items try to make them as powerful as you can or you know just a little enchant can bring big results to your armor okay guys so i think i'm going way too fast but still let's go up to number three i think number three is a very important one you should know uh and so yeah but number three number three what was number three? Oh yeah guys use your environment using your environment is always important and it can help you a lot and so yeah i mean just use whatever you can so use high terrain always make sure to have the high ground i know everybody has said it even obi-wan kenobi has said it so use the high ground very important can bring you some extra attack points if you are in bed wars or in sky wars which i'm not going to show a clip because for some reason i don't have access to those games but yeah use the sky i mean sky wars is about the sky i'm pretty sure bed wars has a sky too so you know lure them into them falling out of the sky that's a good way of eliminating your opponents or use other resources if you're pvping in an open world make sure uh, lead them into a cactus or you know to just simply lava or water you know because water is going to slow them down so if they're having to go through a river and you're already at the other side you can shoot them with arrows facilitating you know again it's going to be on your side and yeah that is tip number three tactic number four is to make critical th hits or combos or you know technically just the right way of fighting for this you know always when you're attacking you want to make sure you are jumping to get in some extra hits so always jump when you're gonna hit a uh, slash with your sword you know duck down when you're shielding or you know place some blocks to kind of uh, block some of the opponent attacks and if the opponent is from a distance you want to use arrows but you want to make sure that you do have some blocks that can make you uh so you can block their shots and you know you can duck behind them and shoot them at the same time while protecting yourself tip number five and it is to use practice you know just practice on whatever you can like you want to practice the target blocks use the target blocks use arrows so you can learn how to aim uh you know in the open world just kill some zombies jumping above them or you know just simply kill chickens since they're the easy easy targets that you can just kill and yeah that's pretty much it number five so if you're ready let's go to the bonus tip 
so here we go so the bonus tip number five is to use other resources uh, on the minecraft battle tab where there's a sword and helmet there's more than just uh, armor sword arrows and bows there is a ton of resources you can use axes you can use pickaxes you can use flint and steel and light your opponents on fire you can use fishing rods to pull them in which also costs damage you can use potions you can use animals or horses to ride you can use an elytra and fly them on or you can use tridents when it comes to minecraft there's just more than just ways to then a bow arrow and a sword so if you're feeling good and creative find a creative way to kill your opponents and you know it's just gonna feel really good and show off your skills show off what you're good at in minecraft so that's the end of the video uh, i hope you enjoy it uh, i think this is gonna be another short video like the other one but again thanks for watching make sure to like subscribe and oh look a, a witch and we'll see you next time uh oh yeah and if you want to know how to find diamonds make sure you watch this video and goodbye